Hey there, it's Alice here. Welcome to this month's energy update. So for the 99 portal, what I'm truly feeling into is around the theme of time, specifically divine timing versus human timing. Ever since I was young, I was really impatient. And while I've changed significantly over the years, I still find myself being impatient from time to time, especially when it comes to manifesting the very thing that I desire. Can you relate? Now, what I've learned also is that what this feeling of impatience truly is, is just a way of my body telling me that this is just fear and anxiety. It is that inner mean girl that is saying that, oh, what you wanted is not here yet, so let's get impatient because it just means that probably you are not good enough, you're not going to make it this time, you're going to fail again. So that is what is causing the feeling of impatience. It boils down to the lack of confidence in self, in universe, and in the timing of the universe. It's common to feel this way though, especially when we are trained to be obsessed with the external results. However, if you take a step back and look at the situation, whatever it is, from a bigger point of view, almost like an eagle's eye view, you might start to see things a little bit differently. Oftentimes, a lot of things in your life right now, it does not make sense to you, especially not for your logical mind. However, when you actually look back and connect the dots, you will find that after all, they make sense. Isn't it? Like, if you don't believe me on this one, I invite you to take some time today to reflect back on your life journey or on your spiritual awakening or healing journey and see if you can discover a specific moment, event, or incident where you are actually so, so, so glad that it did not happen in your own timing for whatever reason that is. Maybe you can find it easily. Maybe for some of you, it's a little bit difficult. But the invitation in this energy update today is to invite you to learn to trust in the universe plan to learn to surrender the timing and let go of control so you can actually lean back and receive rather than constantly be trying to make things happen and getting in in your own way. Make sense? With that, I'm also going to help you to clear some of the blocks that might be causing you to be obsessed with timing through light language. So ready? So here's today's light language, and I'll be working specifically with Mother Mary here. So let's begin. Huna ara ula krada asluna aslu de esulu de una sa eheblese una la aglu de aslu de esulu de akrana asla to ula a ula a ula a la akrana esulu de asuklu nu ula eklu de asla ta oklu tu una esuklu tu ulu oeklesu otakla ta anku tu ula klesu esuklu tu ula krishu de una la klesu eklu tu aple klesu tu utla en klusu ula klesu kletu uklana eklu tu eslu tu ables alklu nu alklu ta kada 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 klesla eklu ta a esengla a anaka a Esuklutu klutu ula esuluta a esuluta esulana esulana. So with that, I end today's transmission, and I will see you in the next video.